Would some Democrats desert the party if their candidate doesn't win the Democratic nomination? Is there a cost to the Democratic Party of the continuing fight for that party's nomination while the Republicans have already decided on John McCain? Well, let's look at some fascinating data here. Let's look at Hillary Clinton voters. And we said, who would you vote for in the general election if Hillary Clinton loses and Barack Obama is the nominee? That is Obama versus John McCain in November. A significant defection here. 28% of Democrats who now support Hillary Clinton say they would vote for McCain in the fall if the Democratic nominee is Barack Obama. What about the other way around? What if Hillary Clinton wins the Democratic nomination and it's her against John McCain in the fall? Well, there's some defection on the part of Barack Obama supporters, people who support Obama now for the nomination, but it's 19%, not as big as the defection we saw among Hillary Clinton supporters. The bottom line out of all of this is it looks like there is a cost to the Democratic Party. You've got the Clinton and Obama campaigns fighting one another, and our data right now show that a not insignificant number of Democrats would desert the party if their candidate doesn't win. But at the moment, these data certainly suggest that there could be a problem for the Democrats having this fight still going on for their party's nomination. I'm Dr. Frank Newport, Editor-in-Chief of the Gallup Group.